Over the weekend, thousands toured the booths and displays at the annual home sport and travel show in Bemidji. Uh, Josh Peterson shows us how much impact the show has for its vendors. The show is said to offer something for everyone. And during this year's home sport and travel show, a record number of attendees walked the concourses of Bemidji's Sanford Events Center. While the event showcases many businesses, the purpose of the show is to fund the Bemidji JCs so that they can continue running their community projects. It's honestly our biggest fundraiser of the year. We run it to pay the bills for the whole entire year. Heimlog Homes has been part of the show since 1987 and since then the event has been a key part in showcasing their product and their overall business. We found it to be a really good outlet for our let people know about what we have and as a result of that we built several log homes in the area. While the event is a fundraiser for the JCs, the show also provides an opportunity to help others out. For the organizers of the show, the event offers more than just home sport and travel. It's also a great opportunity for nonprofits to get some much needed exposure. Not only do we use it as a fundraiser for ourselves, but we open it up to nonprofits and local businesses so that they can come in, get their name out and um, hopefully help them as well. Camp Oak Hills was recognized at the show as having the best nonprofit <laughs> booth. The camp's program director says that being part of a show like this is extremely valuable. This is one of our biggest events that uh, connects us with the community. Uh, we're able to, to come out and meet lots of families that are in the community and uh, it's just been always great exposure for us. Through the support of both vendors and the public, the Bemidji JCs can now continue helping and supporting the community. In Bemidji, Josh Peterson, Lakeland News. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.